Hey everybody, welcome back to Sandow Kayak Adventure. It's freaking sunny. It is like 8, 15 in the morning. It's the first sunny day I've seen for months. I'm freaking excited. I'm also winded, I'm like hauling butt against the current to try and get this uh, bait. I've got a guy from Texas out here with his family. His name's Kyle, he's a big time fisherman. He fishes all over the place, fish forever. Fished off a kayak, fishes off boats, does speckled trout, uh, red drums, all that kind of stuff in Texas. So he's excited to come out here and do some halibut fishing, that sort of stuff. But dude, it's sunny. So you guys just got done watching that two days in Mission Bay. Holy crap. These currents are ripping, dude. I'm like pedaling my arse off and not making a lot of headway. But when, once I turn, we should be golden. Right now I feel like I'm running a marathon. Sitting here in line for bait and I'm just thinking, welcome back, San Diego. Good Lord. It's good to have you back again. I don't feel like I'm in a Twilight movie. Nothing but gray and no sun, man. It is freaking turned out to be awesome right now. Good job, bro. You stay chill. See what happens when we work together? You! There you go, buddy. I had a nice bite, but it popped right off. Well, I, that's why I tell people like fishing with two rods, like you're fish looking at one, looking at another, and then all of a sudden you grab this one when it goes off. And uh, I've lost so many fish fishing with two. I'm like, screw it. Yeah. I'm gonna fish with one. Kind of watch it over my shoulder, make sure that lady in a sea dude no one's getting in her way. Well, just you know, we have the right of way everywhere. Okay. All right, guys, check it out. Today we are doing the three dollar reel challenge. My wife. Roxanne got this at an auction. She always goes on auctions to buy just any sort of fishing stuff. And so she's like, hey, I can get this reel for three bucks. <laughs> like, let's do it. So today we've got a free rod that someone gave me that fished with me one time, basically gave it to me as a tip. 
and then I have a $3 reel. So the grand total of this combo for me is a $3 combo. I just caught my first halibut with it, little 15 inch or so. Let's see what this $3 combo can catch today in Spanish Landing. $3 combo challenge, you. Dude, I'm on, dude, this thing just took off. Dude, it just took off. This has gotta be a donkey. Dude. Come on, baby. Oh, it's a big old Corvina, dude. It is a big Corvina. This is a big ass Corvina. <laughs> You're going home with a fish for sure if I land this thing, which I feel like he's, I feel like he's hooked pretty good because he's been, dude, he's not coming. Come here, bro. Dude, this might be my PB Corvina, dude. This thing's huge. Bro. Wow. Dude, he is. Get tired, that's fine, bro. Get tired. Wow, this thing has got just energy for days. I have to fish grip this guy, I believe. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to flip him in. Dude. This guy's... Are you on? This is a big Corvina. That's going home with you, brother. All right, man. Ride the dog. Dude, he caught that off the bottom. And this is a topwater fish. That's what I'm saying. It's shallow. If they see it, they're going to get it. Nice Corvina. So did you guys hear the drag on that rail? <laughs> it's not good. It is not good. It was like tight as a mofo and I was like and stop and just tight as a mofo and stop. So I'm going to keep fishing with it. I really hope this doesn't cost me a big halibut or something, but maybe spend more than three bucks on your reel. It's not exactly uh, amazing, but we'll see. Please don't cost me a big fish $3 reel. That Corvino was huge. That was a big one. I just measured it, uh, 22. Uh, but yeah, when it was taking the drag, I thought, oh God, I've got a huge halibut and my drag sucks. Like I was instantly thinking I was screwed, but luckily it held. 
Sounds like a whole bunch of plastic grinding together in here. <laughs> but we'll see. We got her back in there out water. Old trusty here. <laughs> we'll see what happens. Oh, okay. I want to make sure we stay away. I didn't even see him. Any luck? Any bites? Oh, nice. He just missed something. I just caught a little uh, 15 inch or so. Dude, I'm hoping this turns them on. The sun. I'm hoping the sun makes these guys hungry finally. You too, brother. Good to meet you. What's your name? Corey. Corey, good to meet you, Corey. Pretty sure I got another Corvina my awesome drag. Oh, I see him. Definitely a Corvina. These Corvina are big and strong today. Another Corvina, just, they swoop down from the top and poof. Are you still fishing on the bottom? Yeah, just doing the exact same thing you're doing. Okay. Yeah, I was just trolling the bottom and all of a sudden, brrr. Yes, sir, Sand Dog. I appreciate it, brother. You're just gonna have to kind of play and see, and sometimes I can get them out, sometimes they pop off, but we'll see. Yeah, you can feel them on there still, I bet, can't you? Maybe if you open it up and let him like run a little bit or see if he goes somewhere. Um, I would stay more on top of him. Cause that way you're not pulling him through, you're pulling him out kind of thing. Kyle's trying to finesse this guy out of the eelgrass. <laughs> You're about to get some swells, just so you know. <laughs> you. Yep. <laughs> it's like, come on. And if it breaks off, you guys, I'll just re-rig it. Right. <laughs> now they do just wrap around that grass. Yeah, they'll go in and like hang a left or hang a right, and next thing you know, they're kind of like just in it. And if you work it out slow, you might be able to just slowly pull the grass out, you know what I mean? Ah, right. oh, damn.
seen him. The giant spotty. These are the spotted bay bass. Wow, that's, that's a pretty big one for the ones I've seen you catch. Yeah, that's a nice one. I thought it was a halibut the way he was fighting there for a while. Oh, and he's gut hooked, damn it. I gotta cut it. He said they're oily, not to eat. Correct. Yeah. These are the ones you don't want to eat. Little spotty. There he goes. 